Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. <laughs> all right, you guys, I was laughing at something, but anyways, y'all, all right. So I have a small haul. I do not know how two items is gonna look. I have another item that's coming tomorrow. It's just gonna be one item. It's actually gonna be another um, Jesus cross ring. But anyways, you guys, uh, let's talk about, uh, first of all, before I show y'all the order, let me give me some drink. I just got home. I am like thirsty and I'm hungry. It's like 1230 already. I'm starving. And, um, anyways, so... I'm here at home, and I'm going to show y'all the outfit of the day. I thought it was really cute what I put on today. I put on one of my one pair of my uh, Tamu.com shoes. Um, I've got to check my stuff over here, make sure no one has come in here and messed with my things while I've been away. Um, I got an alert. So, I want to uh, make sure I need to check my stuff to make sure that uh, no one has came in here. I kind of left everything a certain way. Um, I'm not going to say how I did that because I would be stupid to say that. But I did get alert. But anyways, you guys. Um, yeah, let's talk about a few things before I get into the haul. Because I'm not... I'm kind of scared to open up this package because I don't know how two things is going to look, but we will find out. Now, number one, y'all, my Sheila Shemay channel, I don't know what's going on. Is anybody else having problems like this? My numbers are fluctuating. Like, I looked at my views and on my uh, birthday dress, I had, I think, 2.6 views, and now it's, like, down to 57 views, and then I had 500 and something on both of my, um, I mean, the next video with the really beautiful, like, classic dress, I had also, like, 2 point something uh, views, now I'm down to 1.3 um, and then I've got some likes and then I got two videos where I showed the confetti dress and also, um, what was the other video? I made two videos. There's another one, a haul, I believe. And I had 500 views, over 500 views. And I don't even know what the heck is going on. I remember this happening back in the day. On my Sheila Shemay channel when I used to create makeup videos that had happened. And I honestly do not know what's going on. What I'm going to do is just on the safe side, I'm going to um, change my password. I don't know if somebody hacked into my account or what's going on. Now, sometimes YouTube does this type of thing. Sometimes where, you know, um, I forget what you call it. I've heard someone else on YouTube talk about that. So I'm just keeping an eye on my Shuda Shemay channel and just trying to figure out what's going on. I might even send an email to uh, YouTube just to check out. I mean, it's okay. I can access my account and all that, but I just don't understand my numbers and how it's all uh, went from 2.5 to down to like 57 views. I don't understand that. I don't even know how that came about. Um, like, what the heck is going on? And it all happened. This all happened over Veterans Day holiday. And today is the 16th. But it's been going on because I created my video on the 9th on my birthday. And it's been going on. It was good up until I think it was Sunday or Monday. And then I checked it and I thought, what? And then I checked it again today and I was like, what the heck is going on? 
So, anyways, you guys, we will see. Um, I'll keep a check on that. If some of y'all have went over there and checked out my Should Should Make channel, please do so and look at my videos. But I will get in contact with YouTube concerning my views because they just been fluctuating uh, since my birthday uh, video. Um, it just hasn't been normal. And I can easily get in contact with YouTube and ask them about my views. But please go over there, check out my uh, fashion videos. I would greatly appreciate it, y'all. Um, I really, really love my, uh, <laughs> my whole, all my videos, the hauls, the video, everything. I just don't know what's going on. It's like it goes up to... 2.5 views and then it goes down to 37 views then 57 views it's just all over the place but i've had i have had youtubers tell me that that has happened before on their channels and i got 10 extra subscribers okay that's really strange isn't it like you <laughs> okay i i'm going to contact youtube they will know exactly what's going on here pertaining these few videos for my birthday on up to right now. But you can expect a fashion video next week. I'm actually going to create one probably uh, sometime this week and have it ready or either early part of next week because right now I'm getting groceries, y'all. went grocery shopping today and all that. So I don't know. I might create... Oh, there we go. Okay. Um... Anyways, I will um, create a fashion video uh, as soon as I can, you guys. And I will have it ready and available to watch straight up next week. So stay tuned for that. And also, you guys, there was something else I want to say. Uh, y'all. Y'all. <laughs> I got another email. Y'all, I don't know. This 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 may not be real. It might be fake. I don't know. But I am feeling the vibe of it. And I'm feeling it very good. Y'all, amazing. Amazing. I don't want to talk about it because most YouTubers don't even talk about emails that they receive or something that they may receive that's very, like, encouraging or something spectacular. We'll have to wait and see, okay? <laughs> like, we have to wait and see. I just been very, very myself, calm and relaxable, but I've been very, very happy, okay? Even if it's, I don't know if it's real, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if it's real because you can get emails that's not even real, and you think that they are real. And then sometimes they, most of the time, they are real. So it's like, oh, thank you. I love this. This is like a happy birthday gift. Even though it's so odd how this is happening to my views while it's my birthday time. But I still got a birthday gift. <laughs> so I'm just like happy and excited. And I'm really ready to show that dress. I really am. That Tamu dress back there, I'm really ready to show that. So, y'all, I am overjoyed with happiness. Like I said, happiness, peace, joy, uh, love, kindness. Oh, it's just, just, you know how it just comes inside and just takes over? Oh, my God. And, y'all, oh, my God, y'all. Also, oh God, I don't want to tell y'all everything, okay? This is like car chat type of stuff. I like to tell y'all this in the car. I don't like to say it here, but anyway, it's still been plummet, but y'all, it's so much <laughs> going on. <laughs> I'm so excited. It's not, and the thing is, it's not that it's not bad. What I'm talking about is not bad. See how... God works in mysterious ways. It's like you can go through so much bad stuff and things are going on in your life and God can put a smile on your face even from the a, a, a type of situation that you least expect. 
but yet he put a smile on your face and you're able to get on here like I am right now, just smiling and laughing and thanking the Lord for everything. Oh, I haven't felt like this in years. The last time I felt like this, y'all, was back when I had my, my first apartment and I had fixed it up. Everything was going good financially. Everything was so good. That was the last time I felt this good feeling here. So it feels amazing. I mean, no matter what, like today, the devil tried to tempt me. He did. He tried to tempt me in so many ways, and I had to stop. I was like, nope, girl. You, nope, nope, nope. You have received some really good feedback. You have received some good things. You have had a wonderful, spectacular birthday. The devil tempted me, or I don't want to say tempted me, but the devil tried to mess up my birthday with the dress and all this stuff. But y'all, <laughs> I'm so excited. I got just the most amazing two emails I have ever received, okay? So that's why I say don't give up no matter what. I don't care what may come your way. I don't care what it is. Oh, for me, it was like my birthday. And that means a lot to me and for you guys too. But y'all listen, God made a rainbow out of, like he just turned the storm into a rainbow, into a sunshine, you know what I'm saying? amazing god is so good if y'all i hope if y'all believe in god y'all know how i feel right now like i am so happy like <laughs> i was grocery shopping i was like sheila there was some songs like i think it was one song came on that really got to me because i think it was a gospel song or something and it kind of like touched me a little bit and i was like getting ready to just like do my little you know like, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> and I was like, no, girl, because you got to get these groceries. You don't want to be sick later, okay? And I had to go to two other places, but I didn't go but one other place outside of that. But, y'all, I am feeling so excited. This smile is so, it's so beautiful to see. Again, it's a nice smile. And... <laughs> I'm just overjoyed with just God's love and peace and kindness and oh, it's just all inside and I just feel so good, you know, um, and I had to come back over here and just share it with y'all. I know some of y'all like, okay, probably, but some of y'all going to be like, yes, about time. <laughs> I know I, I'm still hey i'm still striving for justice but i'm so happy i am thrilled y'all just don't understand how happy i am i am so happy okay y'all now we'll talk some more but let me go ahead and open up this tamu.com um package because y'all let me tell you what's in it i'm gonna tell you right now i got two wigs and they're full wigs. Well, no, one is a lace front. And then one is like, I don't know, I have to look at it. It's supposed to be like a, it's supposed to be lace front, but the way it looks in the inside, it doesn't look like a lace front. I want different looks. Like today, I love this wig here. If y'all haven't noticed, I've been having my hair like this uh, for a while. I feel like this is the perfect wig when I want that updo. When I pull it down, the back is longer and then it's, the curls is shorter in the on the side. So I prefer to wear this wig when I want an updo. That's what I've realized over the days I've been wearing it. I do like it down, but I prefer it just like for updo looks, okay? So, yeah, y'all, I love the updo looks with this one, but we'll see about the other ones because they're going to be short too. I didn't want something too long. Um, I don't know. I, I just thought that the price was good. And Tamu, y'all know, once again, I'm going to explain Tamu.com again. Tamu.com is an excellent 
uh, site to shop on. It's similar to Shein.com. Um, I feel like Tamu, though, is cheaper. I think the quality of their things, I haven't bought a lot of their stuff yet. So I can't say this is not like a thorough re review. This is like a mini review. Um, I feel like their stuff is, is not as it doesn't have as much quality as she in and some of y'all gonna say what you mean because she in can be like some of this stuff can be like quality so i think she in has stepped up a lot she in stuff is amazing okay i think they done stepped up a lot their stuff is so much better not that they were real bad in 2020 when i first started ordering but i do feel like uh their stuff, they, their quality has gotten better over the years uh, since I've been ordering. And so, with Tamu, I feel like Tamu is back where she in was at one time. But do I like Tamu.com? Yes, I do. I particularly, very much so, recommend their shoes. Oh, my God, y'all, I got a pair of shoes on right now. Let me see if I can show it to you. Y'all probably can remember these. Y'all remember those? Okay, I'm going to stand up and let y'all take a look at them. I got these pair of shoes on. You remember the ones that look like ice skating shoes? I got these on today, and they were so comfortable. I was thinking about wearing my colorful ones. Like, I have a pair of yellow ones. I have a pair of red ones over there. I even have the nude color. But I thought I'd stick with black and white because I got on black and white today. And I absolutely like the combination. I love the shoes. I love the sweater. I love the top underneath. I love the sparkles on my top. It's just so cute. What? Diamonds are girls' best friend. <laughs> All right, y'all. Love it. Love it. Okay? All right, y'all. So, anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get into the gift. Okay, let's see. Let's see about these wigs. Okay, y'all know I'll be showing y'all my wigs. So now, y'all know, since I said that, y'all know that I will have different looks. That's just the way it's going to be for my fashion videos, over here creating makeup videos. Whatever I do, I will have, may have a different hairdo. And that's not nothing new. I, I see a lot of YouTubers that switch hairstyles and hairdos and all that. And I think it's wonderful. So I am so happy to have some collections. I have some collections again. God has blessed me with a collection of wigs here to change and switch into. So I'm just so I'm I'm just so happy and so thankful. I really am. I am so thankful, so happy, and appreciative, and I thank the Lord for all of it. I do. Thank you, sweet Jesus, okay, because I feel good. All right, y'all, let me open up, open up this package, okay? All right, y'all, so this is the Tamu, okay? I got the bag, because I don't have a lot. I have two wigs and a pair of sunglasses. Okay, these sunglasses I thought was really nice on this model. Oh, my God. The model is absolutely gorgeous. Like, I saw the model. I saw the glasses. And I was like, you know what? I'm getting these glasses because the glasses look good on him. And I was like, I don't know how they're going to look on me because these are men sunglasses. But I don't care. I said, these glasses are so cool. I want a pair. So, y'all, I got them, okay? They wasn't that high. I think they were $2, two or something or $3. I don't know, something like that. So, I got them. Yes, I did. <laughs> they look good on the model. So, I was like, okay, I'm going to try. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> All right, y'all. So, oh, oh. Did I get a coupon? Did I get a gift? Wait a minute, y'all. Hold on. Did Tamu give me a gift? <gasps> Wait a minute, y'all. Let me read it. Let me read it. Oh, gosh. They gave me a great case again. Okay. Tamu is really good. If y'all doing some Christmas shopping, it's the perfect time right now to start shopping. You can buy some things, find some things for Christmas. 
on, on Tamu.com. Uh, exclusive gift times two. Okay. Y'all, let me read it again. Tamu exclusive gift times two. Congrats. You've been selected. Gift one. We've included three gift cards for you to share with your friends and family. New us users can pick one item for free. All right. So, okay. All right. I hear you, Tamu. <laughs> so, that's a discount code on each of these cards. Thank you, Tamu.com. my god like <laughs> i know y'all probably said girl calm down no it's been a long time y'all okay it's been a long time <laughs> okay that's a gift okay thank you sweet jesus <laughs> some of y'all gonna feel me okay all right i am excited like <laughs> that's more stuff like that means you get a discount, you get more things. Like that's they already cheap. So if you get a discount, they even cheaper. So it's like, thank you, Tamu.com. I think that's what you pronounce it. Or Team You. I don't know if it's Team You or Timu. Whichever way, you know I love you. You know I've been uh showing your stuff on my channel and on my Sheila Shemay channel. Love y'all, okay? Love she in too, okay? I think y'all the same company, but I'm not sure. I love y'all though. <laughs> Way. All right, y'all. Okay, so let's get with the weeds, okay? So we got a blonde one and a brown one. So let's go with the blonde one, I guess, okay? This one's supposed to be the front lace, okay? This bang, y'all, is getting in my eyes. Um, so, this is how it looks. Comes in the bag. So, yeah. Let's see what it looks like. Uh, la, 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 la. It does have a piece of lace. It's a teapot. Oh, yeah, it's good. Okay, it's good, but it's shorter than what I thought it was going to be. Quite honestly, this is what it looks like. has dark roots, and it's blonde. Um, and you know what? It's short, but I love it. Y'all will see me rock this. And see how soft it is? Like, you can tell it's a teapot. Like, right up here, it's not thick and bulky. So, that's a darn good wig. Like, for real. That's a good one. So... Here's another one, y'all. Y'all be seeing me rock this, okay? So, not mad at it, okay? Um, I always check to make sure it smells fresh because people go in my stuff all the time, you guys. But um, I like the little, uh, like, waves a little bit. Um, I do. I like that look. And it's supposed to go on the side. So the part actually goes on the side. So that's why it kind of looks like it's not even, but it is. It goes on like this. Like the part goes on the side. So there is the Timu.com. Y'all think this wig was $7, if I'm not mistaken. I think it was like $7 and some change. I caught it while it was on sale. And they had it at a certain amount of time to get it for $7 and some change. So, I got it. And here is the brown one because y'all know I've been uh, rocking the brunette, uh, the brown hair lately. So, let's check this one out. This one, I do not know what this one's going to look like. Because after I got it, I said, girl, are you really going to take a chance with this weed? Because, oh my God, this one is thin, y'all. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. I don't think this is going to be wearable. Oh, my God. Y'all, this just goes on top of the head. <laughs> I'm not going to laugh. This is, uh, what is it? Like a wig? Uh, what is it? What you call these? It just go on the top of the head. I thought it was a full wig. Okay. Uh, 
But you know what I could do is I can make this. Look how pretty that would have been if it was a full wig. I thought it was a full wig. So I could actually put this on with this and have a ponytail. Yes, I can. I can use the clips in the inside and absolutely put it on the back and make a ponytail. <gasps> yes, I can make a ponytail. So this could be a great ponytail. Um, a great ponytail, okay? Because I'm going to try that and let y'all take a look at it, okay? We're going to try that. That could be great for a ponytail. I did not know that was like that. But you know what? That's good. Like if you're... Uh, I, I've seen that. It's a name for that. It's like when you do your hair, um, when you get to the top, you can put that on the top part. Um, if you're using extensions, I remember um, a few uh, people that um, was uh, talking about that. And even on YouTube, you can find those um, uh, channels where they show you how to use those and actually make those work. And I actually can add that on top of any uh, kind of lace front as well if I wanted to, to just thicken it up or whatnot or something, maybe. I don't know. Um, I've never tried one of those, but I think it'll be good as a ponytail. Like put it in the bag, put a little hair on top of it, put it together and yeah, have me a ponytail. And I might try that probably tomorrow. I think I'll try to do that, y'all. And I'm going to try to create another makeup look, maybe. Because I don't got nothing to do tomorrow um, that I know of. So, hopefully I can create a makeup look and uh, show y'all my ponytail. Okay? Alright, so let's take a look at the glasses. Alright, so here is the glasses. A wonderful thing about this is that I love these cases that the Tamu has. They're very nice. These cases here, I'm holding on to them, but I think I'm going to put this one in my purse. So I do have the other one in a purse too, but I'm going to put this one in my purse so I can put my sunglasses in my purse when I'm not wearing them because a lot of times I just put them on top of my head but sometimes when I bend over I have to reach for something my glasses do shift and move and sometimes come off and sometimes they can break like that so I'm gonna uh, keep this um yeah sunglass holder or glass holder in my purse put it in my purse okay because that's a good one because this one you can actually attach to your purse there as you can see it has a hook there on the side. All right, so here's the sunglasses. I thought these were so cool and so cute that I had, I had to get them. The model looks absolutely amazing with these sunglasses on. He had the white pair. I went for the black one. Like the white pair, had, it was like white around the frame. And I love the black frame. So I don't know if I like these. I'll probably get the white frame too. Um, but I normally like just black sunglasses. So um, I'm going to uh, do what I do, y'all. I don't put nothing on unless I... Um, sanitize my stuff just because I'm still in that routine, y'all. I haven't stopped doing that yet. Like, sanitizing. I still sanitize everything. I sanitize my desk, my makeup, everything, okay? That's just what I do. I do everything like this. Anybody that knows me know that I'm telling the truth. I still do that. So, here is the sunglasses. Let's give it time to dry here. Just sprayed some uh, good like see the shape of these they're so cool and so nice y'all let me go ahead and put these on right now because i think they're so cute okay yes yes i knew that they would be good i felt like these were going to be good with my facial structure um because he had like uh, the model had like really like high cheekbones and, you know, a real structured face. I have a structured face too. So I figured that these glasses were going to look good, even though they're men glasses, but I just felt like these were going to be cool. Look at here. Look at that right here. 
Look at that design there. I love that design. But the white ones, oh my gosh, I got to get those too. But I got the black ones because I thought they were really, really cute. And look at on the side, y'all. Look at that design on the side. Those are cute. Like I said, my favorite part about Tamu.com is their accessories. I think I made that very, very well known that I love the accessories. The accessory, the sunglasses, the um, <clears throat> the sunglasses, the shoes, the jewelry. I will be getting this other ring here tomorrow. I don't know why it split up the parcel, but it did. Um, there will be a silver ring like this. It's Jesus on the cross, and then it has cross on the side. I get a silver one tomorrow, so whenever I want to wear silver, I would have preferred the silver with what I have on today. But however, I love the gold too. But um, that's coming tomorrow, so I won't do a haul because it's just one item. But y'all see it on my finger. So, But anyways, their accessories is really gorgeous. I have some of the accessories there. Like, really nice accessories. Highly recommend the accessories. However, I'm just now starting to, like, try on their clothes. I can't really talk too much. I mean, I, I've i had one good dress. The other one, the confetti dress, it was nice, but it was a little tight on the sleeve area. So, I have to just try out the clothes a little bit more before I can really tell y'all a thorough review of what I feel about to move, but I already got an idea. I feel like it's just like she in, but she in has stepped up and they're like the she in that used to be uh back in the day. It's kind of like just starting out. And I cannot really really say that for certain because I haven't tried a whole lot of their clothes yet and all that. But y'all get my idea. Y'all see what I'm trying to say. So anyways y'all yes I love what I got. I really, really like it. Love my accessories. Love the wigs. Like I said, uh, everything will work out just fine. And so, yeah, y'all, I mean, I'm loving this. So, I'm loving my gift as well. Um, I've ordered a good bit of things from Tamu.com. So, thank you, Tamu.com, for those wonderful cards I appreciate it a lot because, hey, those are discount cards. And it's, it's it will be Christmas soon. So it's a perfect time to actually have those cards and thank you. I feel like that's another birthday gift. Yay! <laughs> All right, y'all. I know. I'm very excited, but I can't help it. I love to be... I love to praise God when God is doing something for me or he is, um, you know, how he can come into your heart and just make everything better. Okay. Like, um, I'm getting better and the Lord is helping me and day by day I'm getting, I, I just, Y'all, where I've been, as y'all know uh, from my chat videos, where I've been and the abuse and everything else that I have experienced in this neighborhood, in this house, um, I'm starting to feel like myself. However, you know, I'm not letting that go, like the abuse. I'm going to strive for justice as long as I can. Um until forever, until I get it, whenever I get it, okay? Uh, but I'm just saying how God can come in and touch you and heal you from within. And everybody will see it. Best to believe it. When I went out today, oh, yes, there was some that was watching and was looking. Oh, yes, they, they be watching and looking because uh, you know I'm famous, right? <laughs> Y'all playing. But anyways, they be watching and looking, okay? Some are friendly. Some are not too friendly. Some be acting. Um, but you know what? They see. You can see when somebody, when God has touched somebody's heart. And when, some, when God has, has touched someone. And healed something from someone. 
they know it. They know it. You don't have to say one word, and I have it, except for now, okay? They can see it. I've been asking the Lord to touch my heart, to help my heart, to move forward from what I've experienced over the years. But I want justice, but I want to move forward so that I can meet my husband and that I can go on with my life and still pursue justice and not sit here and let time just keep going and going and going. I need to be like enjoying life. I need to be spending time with friends and having a wonderful time and being and 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 just thank God that I have successfully took care of my daughter. She's grown. She's living her life. And I can live mine now. You know, I, you know, as a, as a parent, you let go a lot of things and you do what you have to do to take care of your children, whatever that may be. Okay. And, um, so now that I've done that and uh, now it's time for me to enjoy my life and now, you know, find me someone. <laughs> Everybody's supposed to find somebody. You know what? Everybody's supposed to have love. We are supposed to have love. We're supposed to have a husband, okay? Or a wife, you know. It was meant to be that way. So, you know, hey. <laughs> I'm going to drink to that. Yes. Okay, cheers. All right, so, yeah. <laughs> y'all try not to talk too much. But anyways, y'all, I love y'all a bunch. That's all I have to say today or show y'all for today. Um, like I said, look forward to more makeup looks. This lash is driving me crazy here. It's not curled right. It was curled right before I left. And y'all know how it is with lashes. Some of them, they just kind of mess up. Like after you've been out for a while start to sweat or whatnot and it's like one one lash don't look right but anyways um yeah y'all just happy okay that's what that's that's where i'm gonna leave it at i'm happy but i'm still in the process of justice and getting where i need to be in life and god is gonna guide me exactly where i need to be no matter what that may be God is in control. I said to the Lord, God, you is in control of my life. You is first. Whatever you want for me, I take it. Okay? Whatever you have for me, I take it. You are in control. And that's what you got to do, all of y'all, that may be going through something that I've been through. And that is violence. Uh, abuse, all of this stuff like that. And especially feeling or being alone amongst many enemies, okay? You have to tell God, God, you are in control. Remember to say that and mean it when you say it. God, you are in control of everything, including my life, okay? And let the Lord handle the situation. Don't you go out there and do anything. And don't let the devil get tempt you to do something that you shouldn't do. Okay? Don't do it. Okay? And, and even if, there's, if, if people are close to you that is, is tempting you, do not be tempted, y'all. That's in the Bible. Let's try not to be tempted by the devil. Y'all listen, okay? Listen to me. Put God first. And I do. I've always put God first. But sometimes you got to still tell the Lord, God, you are in control. 
you are in control of everything that goes on with me and this world and everybody else in this world. You are in control. You are first in my life. And whatever you have for me, I excel. Whatever you want from for me, I accept. But I'm letting you control my life. And everything surrounding me or around me, you are in control. And when you do that, y'all, you will see God will come in and deliver so much pressure that you've had inside of you that you may not even know or I did know, okay? I knew it was a lot of low was on me. It was heavy and I knew it because I was raised up in church. I knew that it was just all this pressure in this place and around the surrounding area and i was like lord you are in control of this area you are in control of the surroundings around me you are in control of everything inside this apartment and i said god you are in control and i started listening to bible stories i got one that i love y'all i listened to it all night. I don't care how many times I wake up, y'all. God is, is giving back everything people try to take away from me. I was always a person that would, I'd go to bed early, in the, early, you know, and go to sleep. But I was always alert. I've always been alert, you know, wake up, and, you know, be alert, you know, something, you know. And uh, when I was going through all the abuse and stuff, and everything that happened. I'll talk about everything about this abuse at some point, you guys. You will not believe how deep it got uh, with what people did to me here um, in this area. Uh, but anyways, y'all, the Lord came in and delivered all of it. Delivered all of it. And I, I have now, not, I don't have this load no more. Everywhere I go, I feel like I'm I'm back at in my I actually feel like I'm in my 30s and not even in my 40s. I feel like that moment when I was in my 30s when I got so mature, you know, very mature and been through a few things but was on my feet and getting up, dressing up, fixing up, looking good, you know, Going in the stores, doing what I got to do, taking my time, relaxing and chilling and whatever. And, you know, and then come home and say, I thank you, God, for keeping me. Uh, I thank you for giving me the things that I got, whatever it may be. Okay. Um, yeah, y'all. It just feels good to be Sheila. It feels good to be myself again. Okay. It really does. It feels amazing. Just to have not that load anymore. That awful load that was on me. I, ooh, when it came off, I was instantly like, oh, God. Like, woke up and I was like, ah. I woke up one early morning and I just felt just, God just took it off of me. And I was like, thank you, sweet Jesus. Just felt it. Just, And now I just... Praise the Lord. I listened to the Bible story and I have one in particular that I love and I listen to it over and over and over. I don't never get tired of this because it's so true. It's from the Bible. Scriptures are being told to you while they're telling you, they're basically telling you the story, but they're also going by the Bible. They're giving you the scriptures. Amazing. And I just, I just fall asleep to it. Y'all It's so good. So good for the soul. I thank the YouTube channel that have this video is so good. Y'all so relaxable. It's so wonderful. The only problem that I'm having right now is this, this, this couch that I'm slipping on sleeping on this this couch that i'm sleeping on right now y'all it, it, it i've been sleeping on this couch for so long that it's like i need i need an upgrade i need an upgrade and i'm gonna get an upgrade but y'all know what i'm saying like i need an upgrade because you know i looked at some cushions and i'm gonna get a cushion and try it if that doesn't work then you know what happens after that then you know that I'm going to need a sofa, 
something to replace it. But anyways, you guys, <laughs> I'm so happy to be alive. I'm so happy to be 47. <laughs> I'm so happy because at one point I didn't know if I was going to be here. Every day I was crying because I was so miserable and sick and was abused. So I'm so happy to be 47, alive, and, and actually giving y'all this testimony, okay? Uh, don't never give up on God. Y'all keep your faith. Believe in him. Keep your faith. Stay strong. Stay bold. Don't give up. No matter what comes your way, do not give up. Trust in God to help you and to get you get get you where you were but better he's gonna get you where you were at one point you might be thinking oh gosh i remember when i was this and that and that and that you get that and much more keep your faith that's what i did didn't have nothing. Was robbed of everything. Then I got abused, y'all. Then I got all just all they, these people. They they call themselves breaking me down all the way down to the bed, y'all. That's where I was in. All the way down to I couldn't hardly get up out of the bed. That's how bad it got. Okay, but. I am here by the grace of God. I'm here by the blood of Jesus. I am alive. And I am pumped up to make some videos. So y'all let me show y'all my outfit of the day. Okay. We're going to start with that today. <laughs> 